All right, well, when you were driving to Cannes Town, if you're heading for um, Clonus Lee, right, well, you're heading for Clonus Lee, just as you drive into Cannes Town, uh, there's a right hand turn. Some shit. And it, you'll see all, you'll see Greg's van on the side of the main road. All right. Get up off your knees. So fucking confused. Embarrassment. We're here. We have a course today. When you finish your big long walk, this you can have a foot massage. Not grand. Cheap, twice the price. After a couple of hours walking, you'd want about 500 euro to rub my feet. I'm doing an EIA course today. Mark's coming even. Just to keep up to date with all the new and happening environmental shit that's going down, we uh, are doing a refresher on all oh, the Badger did Badger. Um, yeah, we're uh, doing a course, so I'll be late going down to Galway today. We're doing it with Richard Jack. Richard Jack's a lovely man, any man that says any different. What would you do? Take the fucking head off. I'd shoot their dog. I'd shoot their dog. I didn't have a dog, I'd shoot their neighbour dog. And they have no pets. <laughs> Yesterday I had a very interesting day. I like uh, busy days at home, you're just doing a few little things, a bit of this and a bit of that. I had to go into town and get a bit of petrol, instead of a bit of air and tyre. The little lawnmower that I had was after moving around the back, so I got in the back of the baby bull nose and the door closed and I got locked in it. I could not get out. I was there for about 20 minutes going, hey! <laughs> I, And then the light went off, it was pitch dark in there, it was getting warm, and I was there, am I going to have to kick this fucking door out? Anyway, I got saved eventually. Wow, yeah, that, that, I did not think that was going to happen. Fuck's <laughs> sake, the baby bull was trying to get me, it's trying to get me. You could have starved to that in the back of it. In 20 minutes? If you'd have been left there. There's a lad there now and he is fucking waiting for his foot massage. This is many an evening I run around that field, keeping trim and fit, camp tangle, land of dreams, land of fucking dreams. Oh, oh, hello, I didn't see you there. I'm just over in Galway here, burning the midnight oil. A half six in the evening. Finally got Greg to leave the wood. He was getting greedy, you know. Oh, awesome. uh, the lens is so long, that's on. How long are they? The extraction line, I'm hit 50, uh, not at the You better be messing. Ah, no, is it? 850 meters, I clocked it on the way out. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You went over a nice little bump there, Greg. 850 meters. And the good news is it's really, really rough. It's great news. That's savage news. I tell you, lad, if you only knew, if you only knew the hardship us forestry men deal with. And we swallow that shit up, no bother. But you know what would be nice for all the effort? Well, no, we have a fucking job at the end of it. That would be nice. That would be nice. That would be nice. Oh, look. Walk your fucking dogs in the rain anyway. Look, look, we're fighting. Who's walking who there? Who's walking who? Move like a dime. Eat me the chini of Vincenzo's. Me and my amigos got their free smoke on the West Coast. Yeah, I'm talking about pre rolls. Dark hair bitch, she look like she go. She do. Long time hero, feeling myself, can't murder my ego. She heard my deep stroke, she said, babe, does it hurt when I deep though? Certified Gregory, pre Gregory, this is some heavy shit, guys. Back then, was a word about me though. It's not not good, no. Oh no, it's good. It's good. I feel like I'm gonna go home and bathe the shit on my wife and kids. Yes, ma'am. But other than that, it's grand. And everyone going around thinking that you listen to fucking Abba and Dancing Queen and Fleetwood Mac. No, 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 no. no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, no. For those of you who don't know, Vicky has the book out. I'm so happy. And the book normally means one of two things. I have to really quickly earn more or I can do less. And I can very rarely do less. I'm making a list. 
You're twice. taking it twice. Yeah. Well, um, oh yeah. Did you see we got our bins? We got our, I, I actually was pleasantly surprised when I came home to see when the bins were there because you had told me, oh, you're going to have to collect the bins, you're going to have to bring them out to the house. I couldn't believe it. Well, I said, um, I heard this bang. And I was like, oh my God, is there someone in the house with me? And then I was like, no, there's somebody. And here, a lorry. I never even heard it coming in the drive. A lorry. A lorry. Yeah, a lorry. A lorry, yeah. And anyway, I went out and here was Danny, Hanlon and Martin. And they were delivering our bins. And I was like, are those our bins? And he goes, yeah, I just got them in your other house. And I was like, and I was like, I couldn't believe it. Very, very you were fucking delighted. Well, I'm delighted too. Thrilled. Because you would tell me I had to get them. I was telling Danny, I was like, we I would be have... sitting down talking about you having to get the bins. If, if she hadn't rang me, I was going to have to go into town yeah. and I would have thought someone had yeah, robbed their yeah. bins. Well, <laughs> <laughs> but like, they took our bags, the, the domestic bags that were to be, you know, that we had left here. Awesome. Yeah, it's very good at them now. In fairness now, they've always been very good. Ryan Brothers would do it. Ryan Brothers would do Dead it. Dead sound. Very good. Dead sound. Oh yeah. Emotional day today. I think he's back to work tomorrow. No, that's just you being emotional, David. Ah, oh, look. I'm, I know it's a big thing for women to go back to work after maternity, but it's a big thing for me to have to change nappies and <laughs> mind the kids and pull my weight a little bit more like that. As a daddy and a father. Should have been doing that anyway. Hey, listen, we'll finger <laughs> figure it out. You're disgusting. <laughs> it looks like I finger on my mind. I was down here at five. It's ten past now. It's great. Before he gets into the van, he has to check his stocks. And seems there any posts? You know yourself now. All right. All right. So that means the lorry will be in. Yeah, the nice one of you. No, I'm not saying that's not a nice lorry, but I think it's a house in the back of a lorry and we passed the other lorry and the other lorry is. Them two baby bull noses hasn't done a tap since we came down to Galway. As far as dirty little 4 by 2 is good, that's a nice one. That's a tidy little set of that now. pretty down here like just looking at that beautiful view you would not think for one second not even for a tiny second that there was a goddamn fucking pandemic out there just getting out a nice little load of pulp and I just thought to myself you know shit's not sorted out with this forestry bill there mightn't be many of them loads left I know what you're thinking David you know we put in our submission and you did and thanks very much but the government still have to pass it and that's gonna be interesting and nobody's using speed here, that's for sure. But I can't wait to see. Will they vote for logic and reason and a system that's in place that's good for the economy and the environment? Or, or will they side with systematic objectors, objectors that use a loophole in the system that is set in place for their protection against their own fellow citizens in a nasty, devious way? It'll be interesting to see anyway. I'm guessing his profession is painter. Is there a man in front of him? He goes around hanging up after him. His lights broke. I wonder... I wonder is he like the best painter down around here? Oh, you can't! If you go down to this wood today, you'll see this lad. Cutting away like mad. 850 meters down the bottom of one wet lane. It's alright, I'll get it. I won't bog, I never bog except that one time, but we don't talk about that. What do you want me to do? What is this for? That's the rail for the door. Look, can you open this? Look, get your fingers out there, look. And the rail travels on, see? Oh. Here. No, no, don't. Here. Bring this in for daddy. This flask. Did this used to be for your drink? 
that's for my drink after yeah, my tea. Come on, let's go. Let's go in. Mammy washed the car for her first day back at work. Didn't she? There's a mint crawler. <laughs> Good night, Tom. Oh, they're very friendly. I, they don't like owls very much, though, do they? Oh, it's not a nice way to treat you. Look, you throw your litter in one side and owls in the other. I don't know what owls ever done. Like, I don't mind if anyone hated fucking bim bash and crows. I should say crows instead of fucking owls. Look, owls. Hey, hey, do you see? Do you see that? That's a double bay of soul destroying fuck sticks. And for the last 45 minutes, I'm gathering them bastards on about 10 lines. Why? For ye Illumina, I mean, IFA members. Just remember that. Don't say I didn't do anything for you, cunts. Oh, listen, do you hear that? That's Greg tearing out. Thank God, because I'm starving. I'm going to get some lunch. You know, I don't know who the haulier is, or what stone cold cowboys will be taking away our timber, but I do know this. There is no way they're accustomed to this kind of work, our standard. Look, look. look at that. There's the stakes. Yes, stakes, my friend, and that is a curve. Pulp. There's the boxwood there. Oh, they'll arrive out to the wood and they'll get a little fucking tiny stalk and then they'll put their crane to my timber and then <coughs> blow their little load out of their little willies all over the gaff. I don't fucking blame them. <laughs> I didn't have to stack it like that. But I did it anyway. We're down in Dubans, is it? Duans, I think. Duans. And um, there's some fucking, that's some fucking artistry in that van. Like, there's some good dicks, and I didn't draw them. You know, it doesn't matter where you are, what county, they all have them. There is window licking farmers everywhere. What's a window licking farmer? Oh, you know. You have window licking everything. You have window licking fucking builders, you have window licking forestry men. That lad there takes the biscuit. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck me. I know the name of the club. Grenons. Uh, Grenons to be everywhere. Just there, there's some fucking. Oh, every one of them. There's some yoke. Fucking. Anywhere they go in the country, just. Load or load everywhere. Not in stop. No. Wherever they get a call, they will they will head down and they will get their pipe out and they will blow it off. That's my grand fee for now, lad. I grew them myself. They're a big man. I can remember them when they were only that size. I'd say you can remember them. I remember them when they were only that size. You probably do. You're four years older than me, dickhead. You. I still remember you. No, you don't. It's a little fucking cold baby. You were going to say a cunt. Oh, well.